Hey, what's going on guys and girls? Alcoholic Phoenix here and welcome to episode number 29 of my Ark Survival Evolve Ragnarok Let's Play series. So, I've done a little bit of work on the base. I've put some trees around using Echo's mods. This, I might have to put a pillar underneath just so it looks right. I put some more trees over here and a nice cool little plant rex. I might move this to a more appropriate spot. Apparently we can be a part of the rex. Oh, yeah. Oh, baby. Hello. Goodbye. Hello. Goodbye. Hello. All right. That's enough of that. Uh, I've also put some hedges out the front of the house with some lights and some nice little fountains here. I think it looks pretty fucking cool. Like, just nice and neat. All right, we'll put this guy over here as well. Uh, yeah, it just keeps everything nice and neat, really. Uh, I put some ramps here as well, and I also added another four walls up around the perimeter of the top floor, just using the large uh, walls in the S Plus mod. And obviously we've got our uh, furnace up here, but today I wanted to make a assault rifle. I've made a bunch of ammo off camera. I also just got a purple drop, and it came with this and a pair of apprentice ghillie suit pants is pretty cool but we've got a thousand ammo there's a shit fucking shit ton of gunpowder that was the thing oh baby oh hell stick them up give me all your money right now i want all the money in little bags with dollar bills on them all right this looks pretty cool I think I should probably get a site for it, but nonetheless, it does look pretty damn dope. Okay, so that was first order of business today. What else did we want to get done today? Hmm. Now, let's also quickly take a look at the comments of the last video. Alright, so, we're going to look at the uh, comments from the last video. Well, I'm going to look at and I'm going to tell you what they said. Uh, Brandy Trim said, there's oil rocks in the cave... Uh, you were getting crystal from, figured I'd point that out. So, yeah, that was my bad. I didn't even think of it, to be honest. I don't know why, even though I've gotten oil from there before, I still did not think of that. Okay, so, also, uh, Rage Death Ray wants me to show the cords of the Ice Cave. I will do that sometime later in the video. Joshua Taylor asks why I won't make videos longer. This question gets asked time and time again. The simple answer is I just don't have a very high upload speed. Um, part of it's I don't have a high upload speed. Another part of it's I don't have a lot of time to do videos. And I also, yeah, I just, it, it's mainly the ups, upload speed, really. It's not so much the recording the videos. It's just having them uploaded uh, in a reasonable time frame. And I would only be able to do two videos a day if I was to get rid of, um, or if I was to increase the length of videos, it would have to end up being like two videos a day like I used to do. But I think covering four different games in a day is more important. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to fly over to the ice cave so I can show off the coordinates and I'll see you guys and girls in a moment. Okay, guys and girls, so the main entrance to the ice cave is at... 31.6 and 32.7. Alright. If you want, like, dead on. 31.6, 32.9. Is the ice cave entrance. Level 95 die bear, huh? How do you handle an assault rifle is my question. Okay, it's definitely not enough. It's not enough. It's... Oh, no. That's not good. Do I have a Pteranodon at my old base? I may. I may have a Pteranodon. Give me a moment. Let's just see. I don't know what's going to be at my old base. I haven't been here in quite a while. So I don't remember what dinos I had. But I thought I had a Pteranodon. Or did that die? See, I don't remember. It's been so long. I have a Terror Bird. Uh, 
They have a few different things, but nothing that really flies. I guess the Gallimimus is probably the fastest way back. Fuck. I've got so many vultures over here that I've tamed that I don't need. Alright, so I guess let's take the galley, even though it's probably the weakest out of everything. Jesus, yeah, that's a little bit... That's scary weak. That's that's maybe too weak for me to trust. Well, it doesn't look like the Dire Bears attacked my Argy or my Argy's tanking the absolute fuck out of them. Okay, I don't have a saddle for you. Son of a bitch! Jesus, I nearly killed the galley. That was fucking stupid. I did not mean to jump so far off the cliff. Okay, if this thing has, like, a saber run up on it or something, it's done for instantly. Like, one chomp and I think it will die. I'm just trying to keep it alive long enough to get over where maybe I can get my spyglass in range of my RG. Don't die. Mm, that's scary. Okay, we're nearly there. And this is how you get to the ice cave on foot. This is where we whistle passive and get this fucker to leave and follow me. Oh god, I'm gonna kill a galley. It's dead. Damn. It's gonna drop these guys off. I just want to get them away long enough that I can grab my stuff. It looked like the RG handed himself quite well. Alright, let's see. Where's my stuff? That would be a good question. Where the fuck would I have died? Maybe I'm gonna have to find... I'm gonna have to go out of this area, find a rock, and then quickly craft myself a uh, corpse finder. Shouldn't be too hard just to get a rock. Are there any rocks on the ground by chance? That would be good. Doesn't look like there's any rocks in this whole area. Shit. Okay. We can find one. Shouldn't be an issue here. Dire bears everywhere, but that's fine. That's wood. That's not stones. This doesn't help me at all. So, it cannot find my corpse. Are you actually fucking with me? What happened to my fucking, like, my corpse? What happened to all my shit? Where the fuck did it go? It should even show up even if I've fallen through the map. And I don't see it anywhere. Are you actually kidding me now? Where the fuck did my loot go? Where did my stuff go? <sighs> okay, so now that I've got all my... Well, not my stuff back, not the stuff that I lost, but I've made the equivalent of the stuff I've lost, pretty much. Used, like, a bunch of last of my polymer and stuff that I had made and everything to get this done. But I wanted to have a look at the Tech Bench mod. Black fucking pearls. Do not have any of them. Nor do I really have a diner that's capable of getting them. I mean, I guess the Megalodon could get away with it, but it would be very, very risky. So I did have a uh, little thing pulled up here. First thing I'm going to need is I need a foundation to start with. Uh, just a normal foundation would be better. I need a water tank. S plus water tank. Oh no, it won't let me learn it. Okay, there we go. So I need a water reservoir. Okay, we need stone. Shit, we don't need that much stone. Uh, and I need water reservoir S plus. I need an intersection pipe. 
intersection pipe. S plus stone pipe intersection. Okay, that's just some stones. Which means I'm just going to need an intersection. Intersection. S plus pipe. And somewhere to build on, which is what the foundation is for. Should have everything we need. Actually, I'm going to need an intake pipe as well. I haven't learned the intake pipe yet for S+. Plus. Let's see. Intake pipe. Go. Intake pipe. Awesome. Okay. So basically, we're going to be setting up a way that we can get water from the ground without having to have a bunch of ugly pipes going across the planet. So I need to pick this up. Because I messed this up. I was trying to do this off camera to see if it would work. So we're just going to click 7. It's going to put this at the back here, I think. Okay, so I want to place the intersection pipe down. Okay, let's see. Which one's the intersection pipe? This one. Okay, I want to place the intersection pipe down. Like, I don't know, I guess here. And then I want to place this. Uh, I guess I can snap to whatever side I want and then I'll just build another foundation so it doesn't look so honky. Or whatever, so it doesn't look so silly. I wish every time I tab back in it wouldn't punch. Uh, I've got to place the intake pipe opposite the intersection pipe. Uh, uh, requires connection in the water. Did they patch this? Because it's not working for me. Hmm. Interesting. This was uh, something that I looked up that I had people talk about, and now it doesn't seem like I can do it. That's actually really fucking lame. Shit! Ah, well, that was a bit ridiculous. Let's see if we can do six. No, what we need is... Oh, we need another intake pipe, don't we? Because I spent the last one. Some bitch. All right, let's get an intake pipe going. We'll try it from this side. Um, do it as much as we can. We'll try and hide as much as we can. Whenever possible. Uh, that's not what I want to do, though. Is that even what I want to do? No. Why won't it snap to where I need it to snap? Look at this shit. Oh, there we go. God, arc building is funky as fuck. You know, it makes me wonder sometimes why I can't just look at the pipe that I'm trying to build on. Because sometimes it just snaps to everywhere else but the one I want to look at. It's the most frustrating fucking thing in the world. Unless I get like this perfect angle about it. And it's so silly. Is that right? So I could snap in correctly. God damn, this is an awful looking pipe. See that? I fell off the map as I was trying to place it. That's why, um... That's why that happened. Look, I can't place this fucking vertical intersection. But I can place a fucking horizontal one. I bet ya. Of course I can. I don't place a vertical. Can I place another vertical? Looks like, yep, alright. Good stuff. Holy shit, this is an effort and a half. Look at how I have to place these. This is how... So awkward. But it also hides a lot of the piping. So in some ways, it may be worth it. I mean, if we could basically pipe this into the base without it being shown, that would be awesome. Is it possible that we can connect it this way? Alright, guys and girls. So I think I've piped up enough uh, 
I'm gonna try and... Can I remove this pipe or is that attached to that pipe? Let's... Let's just hide all connected pipes. Now, if I go over to here... This should have everything disappear off the side of the map. Oh, fucking awesome. Awesome. Now we got a nice little water tank that should be full of water, or it should be filling up with water. So we should be able to take a drink of this, instantly pop that in there. Nothing. Is not is it not placed to a permanent connected water source? Show connected pipes. So what happens if I place a tap here? I can drink water. Okay, so that's full, but for some reason it won't fill my water container. Very strange, but I can fill it in the tap. Okay. Well, anyway, guys and girls, I guess that is going to be the end of this episode. If you liked it, remember to leave a like. If you want to see more Ark Survival Evolved in the future, be sure to hit that subscribe button. Follow me on all my social media links down in the description below. Thank you all so much for watching, and I hope you all have a lovely day. All right, poise.